Last fall, we introduced you to the National Great Pyrenees Rescue in Springfield after dogs from Texas were taken there following Hurricane Harvey. There have been some big changes since. The kennel where the animals were housed went up for sale earlier this year. As you can imagine, the volunteers were worried. While they paid rent, they were afraid a new owner would not have the space or time for them. So, one very special volunteer couple with very big hearts stepped in. I did not want that to happen. And so my husband just one day said, why don't we buy it? <laughs> and I'm like, all right. So here we are. And we've been uh, here a couple of weeks. Two weeks. Mm -hmm. And it's uh, Lucky Mutt's Pet Resort because they're all lucky because I love them so much. <laughs> Actually, I'm the luck. We're the lucky ones. <laughs> Susan Brennan told me changing their entire life for these animals was a no-brainer. She and her husband are just two of the many incredible volunteers dedicated to saving lives here. Recently, I had the chance to meet a few more of those volunteers and ask questions about how it is they do what they do. From the lowest point in a dog's life, it's really sad. It's heartbreaking. To the highest. They, they'll send us pictures and, and some of their little crazy antics like laying upside down, the feet pointing straight up in the air. It's just so heartwarming. It just makes you cry. National Great Pyrenees Rescue in Springfield works to make sure every dog of this breed has a chance at a loving home. It's a far cry from what you'd find at a high kill shelter. A lot of people, um, you know, they, they don't understand that a rescue is very different than a local shelter. Um, Every dog is given a chance to succeed. Every dog is given a chance to, to find a family. Um, we work with behavior problems. Many of these dogs were once forgotten, thrown away. The sad part is, especially, especially in areas of the South, these dogs are kind of treated as disposable. Um, they, people buy them, and they're these cute little white fluffy puppies. And when they get big, um, they shed. Um, they're too hard for someone to manage, they, they take them to the shelter. Now the people who help the dogs also need some help themselves. Tonight at 6, how it is that they do what they do and the way you can play a major role in their mission.